What's up guys, so in this video I'm going to be showing you all how to play Game Boy Color games and Game Boy Advance games on your Windows Phone 7 or Windows Phone 8 device. And these games include Pokemon, Mario, and basically all these old games that we used to play when we were younger. So the first step of what you want to do is download Purple Cherry GBC from the Windows Phone Store. This app is 129, it's a Game Boy emulator, and I definitely think it's worth getting the full version. It'll make downloading apps, or sorry, downloading games a lot easier, and has a lot of new sound and color options. So after downloading the app, hit it in your app list, and wait for it to load up. So on the first load, you will only have one game, so if you hit choose and play, the only game you should have is Crazy Zone. I have Pokemon Red and Yellow as well, because I've imported those from the web, and I will show you how to do that in just a second. And to import games, what you're going to need is a SkyDrive account, so I recommend setting up, one, setting up one if you don't have one yet. And you're going to also need a PC or a computer to um, get the games on there. So after heading over to your desktop, head over to this website here from CoolROM and it will be in the description to click on and so once heading to the website you will see a list of GBC games that you can download and play and so if the, you can search for a game if it's not here and you can click 25 more if you can't find it but let's just do Pokemon Silver for now and so once the uh, app loads up you can hit the download now link a little on the lower side And you're going to have to wait for the sponsor page to go away for your download link. And then hit download your file. And so I'd click save as right here to make this faster and click save as and then put it in your desktop. So after saving to your desktop, depending on your internet connection, it should, it should save pretty fast. And so back out of this and head to your desktop to find the app. So before clicking on the new folder that should be here, or sorry, the yeah, the new thing, your it might look a little bit different than mine because I have something called WinRAR installed, but don't worry, you don't need to have that. Just right click it and click extract. And so hit OK if this comes up and it should extract and make a new folder on your desktop as well. And so open up that folder and you should see an application called PokemonSilver.gb or something like that, whatever game you got. And then head over to Internet Explorer, go to skydrive.com, and let's log in to your account. So once logging in, hit the upload button near the top. Click select from computer if that comes up. And then go to your desktop and just find basically the PokemonSilver.gb application that you've downloaded or extracted. And so I found the folder here, I found Pokemon Silver, just click on it, and then click enter. And then the file should be uploading to SkyDrive. And you want to wait for this to fully upload before you exit out. And you can see I have other Pokemon games here on my SkyDrive as well from before. And now that it is uploaded, we can head over back to our Windows Phone to do the final step. So heading back to our Windows Phone, we can hit um, sign into SkyDrive, let it access your info. And then if you hit import, you should find Pokemon Silver here to click on. And now it should say it's downloaded. So if you hit the back button and click choose and play, Pokemon Silver should now be on the list. And open it up. And then you hit the three dots on the bottom, it gives you some options, but let's just click play here. And it should start up just like one of your old Pokemon games that we used to play back in the old days. So let's turn the volume up for the sound. And there you go. So thank you for watching guys, I hope you have a lot of fun with this app, I'm playing all my old games and reminiscing and stuff, it's a lot of fun, and I'll catch you guys in the next video.